Good morning, I am Kevin Price. Delighted to be with you. Spend some time talking to you about you and your business on this already Thursday. This hey, it goes fast when you're having fun, and I'm always having fun here on the Price of Business, especially when I have my good friend on William Edmondson, and he's with a group called a company called Abby A B B Y, and they are an executive suite company. Uh, you can learn more about them at Abby A B B Y dot com. And uh, William, real quickly, uh, before you introduce yourself, uh, tell us about <laughs> tell us about Abby. Actually, I, introduce your topic. Anyway, you know what I mean. Sure, I'd be glad to, Kevin. Thank you, and good morning to everybody. Abby is a Houston-based chain of executive suites, and what we do, Kevin, is is we are there for businesses. Uh, We literally are, we provide offices, whether you need a traditional office and a receptionist, the mail services, you want us to handle the copier, have the conference rooms and technology available for you, you need it, we got it. That's great. I appreciate that uh, that insight on what's going on there with Abby. And by the way, you can always get more information about them at Abby, A-B-B-Y dot com. Tell us what you, your topic is for us today. Yeah, Kevin, you know, in today's world, things are changing so quickly with the advent of technology, with the, with the mobile worker, with people literally changing how they office and what their needs are, that Abby is, Abby is not only keeping up with that, we're trying to be proactive. Um, not too long ago, you and I spoke about how we did a, a prototype location uh, near the Galleria in Dallas at our Abbey location there. And uh, I'd like to talk about some of the, the signature items that we tried out there and then talk a little bit about the technology. Okay, go right ahead. Sure. Well, you know, today's workforce, people literally are just working differently. They're, they're carrying their laptops. In fact, a lot of people don't even carry laptops. Now they're carrying iPads. They're using their, their smartphones, and it, it's created a different environment. So, you know, we've got to be ready for what people need. Uh, consequently, in our locations, we have been renovating at a very quick pace uh, at our different locations to add things like uh, an example is uh, we have something called a collaboration room, and we're adding it very quickly to different locations. And the collaboration room uses an integrated technology where literally, if you and I were working on a project together, we, we might meet in this collaboration room, and we would both hook our laptops into this, into this uh, hub, literally built into the table, and we would have a conversation about maybe an idea that we're, we're working on. You would, you would push the, the button uh, for your computer, and it would come up on the screen. You know what you're talking about, your idea. I might then push my button, and it would come up with what's on my computer screen, and it's all on a big screen TV on, on the wall right in front of us. And then we hit a few more buttons. The so next thing you know, we got a slugfest going on. you got to watch that <laughs> button push it. That's pretty cool. So how many of your locations have this collaboration room? Uh, right now we're up to four, but by the end of the year we'll be up to, I believe it's seven or eight, and we have big plans moving forward. In fact, Kevin, we just we have literally... In the last week, we finished a renovation in New Orleans at our St. Charles location, which is right in downtown, and it, it, it looks fantastic. Um, we've got it at our uptown location at 2425 West Loop South. Uh, we've got it currently in Dallas at the, at the location, uh, North Dallas Quorum, uh, above the Galleria. And we've got several other renovations taking place literally as we speak. Yeah, very cool, very cool. And in comparison to size, how does a collaboration room uh, compare to a conference room in size? You know, it, it's fairly similar in size. There's, medium, there's, small, or large? It, it's like a medium-sized conference room. And what you would see, Kevin, is, is you would see a table mounted up against the wall with the with a big screen TV that, that you know acts as the shared computer screen. What we did that's different that really reflects the psychographic of, of Gen X and Gen Y or, or Millennials is the tables are bar height. So you, you've literally got bar stool height chairs uh, around this table. And we find that a lot of people prefer working like this. You know, a lot, a lot of times people tell you about ideas that came up on a cocktail napkin. That this, is, this kind of follows that, that same route. Um, in these rooms, we also have enough room to walk around and We've got these really cool glass whiteboards up on the up on the wall, and you know you look at these rooms. They've got a glass front on them. It lets the light in. Not only is it real inviting, it just makes you feel like you're going to come up with ideas and makes you want to collaborate and share. 
Yep, absolutely. Talking again to uh, William Edmondson. Really cool idea. I need to come by and expe- inspect uh, one of those. Uh, like from the station, Hillcroft and 59 area, where are a couple of locations nearby that have the collaboration room? You know, the, the closest one would be at 2425 West Loop South. Um, also, our Wilcrest location on Westheimer uh, has it already. And uh, we're actually going to start renovation at several other locations here uh, between now and the end of the year, including our Greenway Plaza location. Yeah, very, very cool. Talking to William Emerson, and uh, I love learning about what's happening at Abbey, and Abbey does a great job of helping businesses of all sizes, big companies looking for an annex or looking for an extension office. Um, virtual office for, for the individual who's trying to get out of his house, you know, and gets tired of having, uh, you know, people uh, send mail to uh, Mockingbird Lane, which, you know, may be a great, <laughs> mo- you know, TV show setting, but not a great address for an office sake. Uh, really phenomenal what you're doing for companies out there. Uh, it, now here we are in August, second half of 2013. We're coming now to the uh, final stretch, hard to believe. So what's going on with this, you know, 30 seconds, what's going on right now in terms of uh, types of of decisions people are making as far as their offices? You know, Kevin, we we are just seeing an an incredible uh, amount of of energy in the the market right now. Not only are we seeing people testing out Houston as a a trial market and maybe getting one office, um, we're seeing more people split off and go on their own. But what's just been incredible is the amount of people taking advantage of the new virtual packages we have um, where you don't need a full-time office, but you you know, you need a place to work, uh, take advantage of the wireless uh, that we have in our locations. Maybe, maybe mail is most important to you in that address. Maybe having the wireless is most important. Maybe it's the credibility of the conference rooms we have, but we have, we have just literally been flooded with uh, new clients that are really, really embracing this this new style of of working as we as we move forward in the economy gotta go william emerson he's with abby abby at abby.com abby spelled abby also a uh, phone number hey you can give us a call toll free at 888-785-8800 that's 888-785-8800 and please let him know you heard about us on the price of business All right, you heard it here, William Edmondson, he's with Abby. Thanks for being with us. More after this, right here on The Price of Business. 